So I'm a big Halloween buff. I mean, next to like Mardi Gras, I don't think there's a better holiday. I mean, yeah, Christmas and Thanksgiving are great family holidays, but when else do you get to go door to door and appreciate people's dark and creative sides and meet strangers other than Halloween, right? So I decorated my house, very G-rated, all like um, Nightmare Before Christmas theme because I have a five-year-old. And, you know, we put out two big pots of candy because we were trick-or-treating as Barbie, Weird Barbie, Barbie, Ken, and Alan. And when we came back, the thing was full, and I could not understand why. I mean, we left the lights on, two big pots of candy. This is a common thing for people to do if they're out trick-or-treating. And so I was watching the surveillance video just now and trying to figure out why nobody was coming to the door, and then I realized my dog was on the front porch right next to the candy and kids were scared of her. They thought she was like a, a like wolf decoration or something. Oh, oh I know. You scare the shit out of me. No, it's just... But then I kept watching. I mean, look at this. Look at this dog. Look at her. I kept watching and then some of the older kids start to come up and start petting her. And then there's a giant crowd building out front of our house of people just waiting in line to pet the dog. And um, they didn't, I guess, take all the candy. They just wanted to see the dog after that. And I thought that was so sweet and so cute. And so I'm bragging on my husky because she's the sweetest dog in the whole wide world. Pat you? 